And welcome back to another episode of The Collector's Review. In this episode, we're unboxing the Evil Dead Ultimate Ash NECA action figure. This is the 40th anniversary action figure, and I caught this at the Target Holothon. So make sure you stay tuned. Let's get to it. to another episode of the collector's review brought to you by the collection dimension in this episode we're unboxing the evil dead ultimate ash NECA action figure this is the 40th anniversary like i said and i caught this at the target the holothon i grabbed i grabbed a couple other ones to do the unboxing for you guys make sure like always like share and subscribe hit that little subscribe button man stay with me i've been dropping a lot of videos i just did a the this is fake i'm the uh batman NECA action figure and i got more to come and i'm gonna be unboxing toxicity now this bad boy right here and then i also got the NECA Back to the Future action figure from there. I'm trying to get uh, some of the other ones. When I went there, a lot of them were sold out. So I wanted to grab a few. So for everybody that wasn't able to get it, to get the action figures to see is it worth it for you guys to get it. So I want to get close up with this box. First off, like I always say, I love the boxes. The boxes, the, the art on the boxes is amazing. And this one, man, they knocked it out the park. I love how they did with the, the cover of it. It's just like beautiful to me. Uh, so like this figure, this box right here is just amazing. So it's winning right here with this. Then you open it up and take a look at them in the inside. A lot of people didn't like the face sculpt. They felt, I don't know kind of plain he goes back and forth with me it looks like I'm kind of and uh but I, I like uh next neck has been knocking it out the park lately got the back right here so I'll top the box right away man is like I, I love the box all around but let's get to it I'm gonna take this bad boy out like I said like always like share and subscribe man I've been trying to drop a lot more videos and I will have a lot more coming and I'm gonna drop these. I'm gonna try dropping these, uh, the other two within this week. Move this out the way. Take a look at the box. They've been actually sending when I, I get the stuff. It's been pretty clean. Pretty clean. And they uh, start using these for some little plastic pieces. I don't know if you guys ever watch my fake versus real or the this is fake. You can see the difference with some, but. Let me uh, take this bad boy out the box. There we go. Got this guy out. Take a close up look at him. Let me get all that stuff situated. I got a little stand for him. Little Evil Dead stand. This did not come with the action figure. You guys know if you guys been watching my videos, get at me for these. Let's stand him up real quick. And let's take a look at the let me get the accessories together. All right. So, comes with the accessories. Look up close at them real quick. So, like I said, this is Stan. Get at me, go to the site, or got a lot on YouTube. I mean, yeah, eBay. Put that real quick. Look up close at Ash Williams. Now, I know there's a lot of uh, people, like I said, they were talking that they didn't like his face. But I don't know, I think they did a pretty good job on his face. The figure all around looks like a pretty pretty slick figure. Again, uh, if you guys been watching my videos with the NECA figures, I haven't been putting them in hot water. I haven't been heating them up or anything like that. So when you guys see me unbox these, these are actually just coming out the box. If they break, um, that's because, you know, the joints and all that, but I don't heat them up just so you can see what it's like coming right out the box. Head up, head down, side, side, arms out. As far as his arms go like that, I mean, you can 
do them like that. But uh, let's see, face test, elbow bent, you can touch his face. That's his elbow bent. Wrist, wrist moves good. A lot of the figures that I've been unboxing for NECA have, haven't had any issues with, really I gotta say lately. Forward, back, and they're still doing uh, different bootlegs. I haven't seen no bootlegs of these ones, uh, the Target ones yet. Legs out, knee bent, foot, all around I've been loving the detail with them that they've been giving and they've been pumping out a lot. So for me, if you guys watch my previous videos, for me, I've gotten a lot of neck figures that uh, break when you open them due to the paint drying but they've really stepped up their game I gotta say but with that comes the price hike and everything's been higher we can look at the action figure the the, the accessories now but I know people have been complaining because prices have been getting higher on stuff but I gotta say the quality they've been stepping up the quality on it And they've been they've been really coming out with a lot of stuff, especially like the Ninja Turtles. They've been coming out with a lot of the Ninja Turtle action figures, a lot of horror. So they're giving us a lot of stuff that we don't have. And yeah, there's still sometimes things that I don't like about NECA, but but it is what it is. Not every company is perfect, but they have really been I gotta say stepping up their game with the action figures and I love the art like I said then they came out with the gizmo the uh, autograph gizmo it's a uh, autograph by Howie Mandel and then also the autographed Elvira action figure And they came out with a, what I'm really trying to catch is Rocksteady and Bebop. I think it's uh, Super Rocksteady and Bebop. I like this. The detail on it is nice. I really wanted to detail even a little connector. So that's a slick piece right there. I like this. But they, they had the Rocksteady and Bebop. The, uh, I think, what is it? Super Rocksteady. An ultimate bebop or something but uh the robot versions from the cartoon and i really really like those but again you guys know there's a lot of resellers out there so wasn't able to get it this time i have people on it though trying to get it for me x but as soon as I get that, I will definitely do the unboxing for you guys to show you guys those up close. And shotgun. I've always been an Evil Dead fan. I love the Army of Darkness movies, man. Growing up watching those as a kid where the Army of Darkness was hilarious to me. Evil Dead. And, and then he comes with two hands one for looks like one for the shotgun and one for the axe and like always stick around till the end because I'll be doing a little close-up on him holding the different stuff with the different heads and hit that subscribe button but I got more coming definitely a lot more videos coming not gonna stop and we're gonna get bigger better and go beyond so like always like share and subscribe man get with me stay with me we got more videos coming make sure you stick around to the end to see the up close of this uh, this action figure right here the evil dead ultimate ash NECA action figure the 40th anniversary until next time we out peace